And Ryan, Ryan how, what do you think of that? All, all is looking good, huh? Absolutely. It's be a nice Delivered day. a nice forecast yeah. there, Nick. Especially for the 4th of July. And, and speaking of that, of course, we will be leading up here to the 4th of July. But Teresa already kind of got a head start on that. Shall, shall we take a look <laughs> at... There was a lot of celebrating the, this yes. weekend. Dante turned two. Yay! Round of applause here in the studio. <laughs> all three all of right. you. All yes. right. There you go. So we celebrated. It was a school bus themed family party. How cool is that? Were Very you the good. bus driver? Did, did you hop behind well, the bus? Well, there was a school bus. Of course. Uh, of course. Right. You know my in-laws. So yeah. we all got on the bus and sang wheels on the bus. No kidding. Yep. That's what you do normally on weekends. Though. Absolutely. Yeah, I okay. <laughs> you have more photos here? Do we have more Teresa fun? Well, uh, yeah. But wait, there's more. Okay. Right, I thought you also were sending no, in some look, pictures. I don't is, think the world revolves no, around this me. This is Teresa's world. We're just living <laughs> in it. Okay. I, so, so we have your dad in the background. <laughs> yes, my friend Jill is there. And Dante took us for a spin around Bantam Lake yesterday. It was uh, my in-laws' annual 4th of July party. So there we go. He has a there license, you have it. though, right? He's all licensed up. He's, he's a certified <laughs> He looks like mariner. it. He's got yeah. his little vest on. He was into it. He was he, really turning the wheel. He was into it. Re ready for 4th of July. A lot of red, yeah. white, and blue there. And, and speaking of that, with yes. that in mind, you'll be seeing a lot of those colors coming up, but especially a specific shade of blue. And now you can help Crayola. They need help naming a new crayon. Uh, it's going to replace dandelion. Remember they retired the that box. probably about a month ago? Yeah. So online voting is now underway on Crayola's website. The choices include, are you ready, Ryan? Right? Blue Moon Bliss, Blutiful, Ooh. Dreams Come Blue, Reach for the Stars, and Star Spangled Blue. Blue, there you go. And you can vote <laughs> until August 31st. Uh, how do you say crayon? Crayon. Cray crayon? Cray, like it's spelled is how I, I say it. I just say it's a crayon, isn't it? Just crayon. A, cra a crayon. All right, well, tweet us. Let us know who says it right. Her, crayon, crayon. me, crayon. I don't know. What I, a pretty I think, shade of blue that is, though. I, I agree. I think Teresa would have to name it how I feel working with Ryan. Blue? blue? No. Nah. It's in the highlight of my morning. Of course, what of do you course. mean? Yeah. All right, so an international coffee trend is making its way to Nashville. All right, yeah, there's uh, a couple of these launching a new cafe. And they're in a few other cities that we've seen. It's called uh, Music Kitty Cafe. This is when right up your alley. Muse, we mean M-E-W, like a meow. But customers can get their coffee with a side of kitten cuddles, because that sounds inviting. Uh, and it's a good fit. Uh, you can take both home. You can adopt a cat <laughs> and get your coffee and bring it home. What, what do you think about this? I'm this is so a allergic cafe. that I would probably <laughs> never make it out alive. <laughs> See, yeah, are, are the litter boxes outside or in oh. the cafe? All right, TMI. Okay, but I, I think this is cute. I mean, I'm a big cat guy. I, would I have you to enjoy admit, just petting a cat and sipping your coffee? Not like it's a, a random, little weird. Yeah, not in a random place, but it's a pop-up shop, and it's all to uh, to support a good cause, all in adopting new kitties, which is nice. <laughs> I, it's, it's a cool twist on things, I guess. But I, I, it's funny, like cats, I think if you have a cat, you can mm -hmm. love it. But I'm just the type of guy, if I, if I meet a new cat or dog, I'm a little hesitant. Because oh, you don't Hunter know. Hunter has your heart. Yeah, Hunter has my heart, I guess. <laughs> As our producer says, move on to the next story, Ryan, because we don't need to hear any more about your cat. All right, it's official. The Top Gun sequel now has a date. Ready. Paramount has cleared Top Gun Maverick for takeoff on July 12th. 2019, 33 years and a couple of months after the original flew into top culture's his, pop culture's history, Tom Cruise is set to return, this time as a flight instructor for a new generation of probably very attractive young pilots. I'm sure. Did, did you have a favorite in the original movie? Did you have like a heart throb? Maverick. I love Kilmer? No, 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 I liked okay. that was Tom Cruise. It was, yeah. yeah. Okay. Just wanted to make sure, you know. <laughs> that'll be a big movie though coming out. I'll go see it. It'll be fun. It'll be good. Uh, that'll it be had a great soundtrack sure. too in the early '90s. Do you want to sing some of the songs from it? Nope. Come on, one. Nope. Just a little something. It was my prom theme. Take my breath away. Come on, give That's me a little. That's it. Okay. Leave All me right. alone.